Hey everybody, it's me, uh, Mr. Fuzzy Lego, and today I am back with another video. Uh, this shouldn't be that long of a video, I only have uh, six minutes to do this anyway, so I'm going to start off with John Egbert from Homestuck. And if you couldn't tell already, my videos are edited, which is thanks to, oh my gosh, he didn't. Uh, I might have to retake that or cut it out or something. He'll do something. But I edit this videos are edited now by my good friend. Uh, yeah, he adds music and stuff, so say hi. Thank you. Alright, anyway, today uh, you see Mr. John Egbert from Homestuck. Uh, if you don't know what it is, I recommend you check it out. It's pretty cool. But I used painter legs and I just kind of took off the the bottom pockets I believe he has yellow shoes I don't know what this thing is but in the reference picture I was using he had whatever this is so I made it anyway uh, he has his little squiggles on his shirt and his hoodie there and his face is based off of his character I believe and his hair came from a different custom that I don't think I ever showed and he dropped whatever that was but yeah this is John Egbert from Homestuck Woo! Alright, next I'm going to show you Asuna from Sword Online. This is the second version of Asuna that I have made, and I think it is really good. If my camera would focus, I could show you Asuna. Thank you. So, I... oh crap. Uh... Uh, come on. Thank you. Uh, thank you. So, I redid the head and the eyes, and I think that they're great. By the head, I mean the hair. I redid the hair, of course. And the legs are all the same. I really think this is one of my best figures I've ever made. Unfortunately, it's not my most popular one. It doesn't seem to get as much recognition as I would want it to get. But, yeah, I think it's great. She has this, her red sword, which is not, I don't think she has a red sword in the anime. But I just gave it to her anyway because she already has red. That's supposed to be a little like she thing. Uh, yeah, my old version of Asuna was really, really bad, and this time she actually does have awesome hair. As before, she did not have awesome hair. It's awesome now. And I'm not gonna make that joke again. If you're wondering, I'm not gonna do that. All right, so that was Asuna version two from Sword Art Online. Uh, the next one is Palutena from Kid Icarus series, or I based this one off Kid Icarus Uprising. Uh, yeah, I spent a little time on this. The shoes definitely took me a really time to do. The dress, like the bottom dress down there, took me a really long time to make with all the different colors and different, like, dress pieces. And the hair is just a piece of paper that I didn't care about. Uh, her, she has her staff here. And her eyes are pretty good. I'm gonna try to zoom in on those eyes. She looks pretty. Um, yeah, she got like her little shield thing there. And overall, I think it did a pretty fantastic job on Palutena. I don't think I'm gonna be re remaking her anytime soon. So that was Palutena from Kitadris. Um, I think that's all the figures I really wanted to show you. I don't have anything else, but I will show you work in progress. My original. Uh, Battle Damage Mega Man, which is something I made last year that was really a very big hit. It was a very good idea, so I decided to start making it. This is a Battle Damage Darth Vader hel uh, helmet or head, and I just painted tan on top, top of it. On the, cause it's originally just a gray hel a gray head, but yeah, uh, it's my old Mega Man that I just kind of fixed up. As you can see, I still need to put that part on the torso, but yeah, he has like his little undies on. He has his boots. And this Mega Buster is not uh, complete yet. Like I said, this is work in progress. So yeah, uh, I think that's really all I want to show you. And then there's one more work in progress. Um, I found a new anime that's similar to Sword Art Online. It's uh, called Konosuba. God's blessing on this wonderful world. And I'm making the main character Mr. Kazuma Sato or something, I don't know, but uh, it's very work, very early work in progress, you see all I have done so far is make his hair, uh, I need to find some way to make the torso. Yeah, this is not, a, this just came from uh, a sort of online character that I scrapped, so that's not his torso. 
Uh, yeah, so he just has his hair right now. It's not done yet, and this head is not final either. Uh, yeah, so I'll get back to you on that. And I think my camera's about to die, so I will see you beautiful peeps later. Uh, say goodbye, Mr. Editor. Whoa! Also, be sure to check out my Flickr, which will be in the description below. But you don't have to do it if you don't want to. I'm gonna go eat some food.